Good afternoon, everybody. You know, I had a few hours to fish out in the Gulf with my friend, and we had some really good action for some bluefish. And now I'm gonna be able to fillet the bluefish right out here because it's really nice down here in Florida. But what I wanted to test today is one of the new vigorous mats that is supposed to be ideal for cleaning fish. Now I've used the black mats in the past that had like the square nubs on top. This is their new vigorous mat. You can see that it's longer. It's about, uh, I'm gonna say 24 inches. And you can see that, you can see right through it. Can you see me there? There. And it's got those little stubs on the bottom that can actually hold, hold the mat down so it doesn't slide around. And these little nipple stubs on the other side, I don't know if I go this way, you can see them, right? That's gonna hold the fish. So I think this mat's gonna work really well, but I'm gonna try it right now. So I'm just gonna get in a position and I'm gonna grab the fish. What I'm liking right off the bat is uh, that the mat is longer than their older one. So I'm going to try putting that fish on there. The mat doesn't really move. The fish doesn't really move. So what I like is that it actually suspends the fish off the table. And uh, if any juices or liquids come off the fish, it's going to go right through the mat and onto the table. So the fish isn't going to slide around. So you can see I'm just uh, filleting it. I'm using a normal filleting technique. Blue fish are pretty easy to clean. And I'm noticing already that the fish is not sliding around, which I really like. So I'm gonna just take off the fillets first and lay them down. There's one nice fillet. I'm gonna do the next one and uh, just make my normal cut. Yes, I filleted quite a few fish. So, and I actually don't mind cleaning fish. So the mat is holding the fish in a really good position. So I can uh, at least work on the carcass. So it's not sliding around. Man, I'm liking this mat. I think uh, the new nipples on top are very good because they're extending the fish away from the actual mat. So there's my two fillets. So now the real test is going to be how easy it is for the actual um, fillet to sit there if the bumps are close enough so I can run the knife through there and uh, do an easy job. So I'm just going to hold one end of the fillet and I'm going to start it. And let's find out here. I'm not using the edge of the table. So I'm actually, uh, normally, you know, when you fillet fish, you would have the fish on the edge and you would run the knife down the side. But I'm just gonna see if, uh, even with this knife with the curvature, if I can remove the flesh from the skin really well. And it looks like it's working really well. So those uh, stubs are close enough that I'm not cutting into them and it's supporting the fish just fine. So there's my clean fillet. You can see all the fish is right there. And there's my skin. And I'm just gonna discard that over here. So you know what? I'm really impressed with this mat. If you like the clean fish, check them out. They're from Vigorous. You can go to their website. Notice that uh, there isn't hardly anything on the actual mat because it goes right through. You can see some of the blood that's on the table here. So I, all I gotta do is spray that off, spray the mat, shake it, and uh, it's ready to use next time. Okay, I gotta go clean some fish.